Hey everyone, so today I'm going to start a new tutorial series, and this is going to be for the Yersnet engine, which is a 3D Python game engine, and I hope you like it. So the Yersnet engine is a recently released open source Python based 3D game engine, and it is built on top of the well established Panda 3D game engine. And this is going to be a multi multiple part series, and in this part I'm going to be showing you how you can install uh, Yersnet onto your computer. So first of all, if you already have your um, environment variable set up for Python and you've added the Python path to your system like I did, then all you need to do is open up your command prompt, just type in cmd, and then you can directly run pip install and then uh, your system. And so once you press enter, uh, it should be installing. But as you see, I've already installed it. It says requirement already satisfied. And this is all you basically need to install your stuff to your computer if you have already set up your environment variables. Now, if you have not set up your environment variables for Python, um, then there's one extra step and you just need to open up your uh, Python IDLE. So I'll open that up right now. And once you have this opened, you can click file up here and then click open. And this will just lead you to the uh, path uh, to Python. And so it's gonna lead you to where Python is installed. And once you have reached this location, you want to click up here until it's blue. And if it's not blue like this, you could just click Control A and select all of it, and click Control C to copy this path. Once you have copied that, you can close this, you can close this, and go back into your command prompt. Now just type in cd, and then you want to paste that path here. And then you can enter. And you want to cd again to scripts. Click enter. And now, now that you've located, uh, or now that you went to this location, now you can actually pip install your cinema. And click enter. Again, I already have it installed. It says requirement already satisfied, but for you, it will start installing. And great, so now let's actually check if we properly installed it. So let's minimize this. And I'm going to open up Sublime Text. And now I'm gonna write a little piece of code. So from your snow, import star, app is equal to your snow, and app.run. Now if I save this, and uh, I run what we have, if this appears, if this window appears with this uh, red X at the top right, then you know that you have successfully installed your snow onto your computer. So this is the end of part one of the series. I'll see you guys in the next part.